Australia, dog. <laughs> oh, goodness. Uh, so, I was speaking bad German into this translator. <laughs> it's a great way to start a story. And I basically rattled off a bunch of Rammstein lyrics. Because <laughs> that's all the German I know. And it didn't get any of it. I don't know whether it's pronunciation or what, but it didn't get shit, so... I was like, well... You just have no taste. Tell, talking to the phone. Telling the phone it has no taste. I was like, yep. This uh, Samsung has no taste. And it's racist. So... <laughs> Uh, that's my story. <laughs> what a shit story. Yeah, I was talking into a translator on this phone. Shit. <laughs> that's the whole story. The end. Finished. <laughs> uh. Ah, big ol' shark! shark what would what would a shark want with this cocoa ass anyway jump I'm safe it's all good you f <gasps> another one no 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 Frenchman get away from me Eek! Everything is conspiring against me! <laughs> Crystal, the only happy face I've seen so far. No, fuck off, Frenchman. Why don't you just go run away and surrender more? Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> uh. I'm pr I've probably pissed off so many French people. I did this whole skit. It was like a series of, um... What game was it? I think it was Killing Floor? Yeah, I did this whole session of Killing Floor. That was basically just one big sket, uh, sketch, sketch, sketch thing. Sketching is something else. It was one big sketch. Um, like a comedy thing. Except I don't let on that it is because, you know, I'm based... Um, so people thought it was serious, and I was making fun of French people the entire time. <laughs> I basically did this just series of troll videos where I was making fun of French people, and people took it seriously. Probably French people. That got me a little bit of hate for a while. But like always, the French ran away from the fight. Keck. <laughs> It's friendly jabbing at the French. I'm English, I can do this. But yeah, me and the French. They probably don't like me at this point. Random story time with John Candy 45. I love the insult, though, that's actually called a racial slur on Wikipedia. Like, can you believe it? It's actually called a racial slur on Wikipedia. It's like... Yeah. It's like, um, cheese... I think it was like... Cheese-eating... Swine-swilling surrender monkeys. I'm like, how is this a racial slur? Wikipedia, please. Like, they had it under slurs, racial, like, I think it was racial slurs. I think it was just slurs in general, but I was like, how is this a slur? That's just, like, a long saying. Shit. I thought I could make it. 
I mean, I know it's an insult, but how is that like a slur? I thought to be a s fuck, really. I thought to be a slur, you had to have it be at, like a couple words long, not like this whole sentence. Yeah, I'm gonna insult you with this slur. It's an entire fucking sentence. <laughs> like, it just sounds weird. It didn't double jump, please. Fuck the boxes. I'm out of here. Wait. Oh, good lord. I mean, from what I hear, um, Canadian French people are mean. Oh my god. I did like a double bounce. What the shit? Canadian French people, Quebecers, as, as as my friend refers to them as, are, are all mean to him. <laughs> he knows a lot of um, Quebec curses because they curse at him a lot. And I'm like, ah, oh, that's funny. <laughs> Can't believe I bounced off this thing. Fuck this. That shouldn't be that hard. I hear from every other Canadian as well that Quebecers are mean as fuck. So I'm I'm starting to believe it. I think that there's some validity in what they're saying. I've had three different Canadians tell me that Quebecers are all mean. <laughs> I think that I should believe them. Yeah, they kinda are. They kinda are a little bit. Everyone that I've met has been, so... That's a good sample, right? Kapow. Oh dear, that's a lot of stuff to do. Shit! <sighs> I need to not hit that top box. That would be really great. <laughs> How long have we been going for? Man, two hours. Jeez. What time is it? Oh my god, it's two o'clock. Oh, thank God. Okay. I kind of want to play the guitar, but uh, I kind of have the same thing with recording as I as playing games as I do with the guitar. I don't want to play unless I'm actually going to be doing something relevant. Wow, 10 hours? I don't think I've ever streamed that long, but I have streamed for like 6 hours. I think 6 hours has been my maximum. Yeah, I streamed for 6 hours, I think, and that was like my longest stream. I think that was with Metal Gear Solid 4 as well. Jeez, really? God damn it. I've never done a video immortalizing why I will never play a Metal Gear Solid game, either on stream or recording. I should probably do that at some point. 
shit. I do get asked occasionally, like, where the fuck is the other Metal Gears? You said you'd do them. And I'm like, well, <laughs> nope. DSP has showed me the way of how not to do it. <laughs> Thing is, I suck so bad that I'd probably play it a lot worse than he does. And that would be a travesty, so I'm not going to do it. <laughs> Ever. <laughs> Metal Gear fans are crazy. If you suck, boy will they let you know about it. Hmm, eat dog do. Alright, made it through that level. That was painful. <laughs> it wasn't terrible, but it was pretty painful still. Alright, we're on the boss. So we've got one last warp room to go now. Engine and Coco is going to take the lead. <sighs> Same reason why I won't do Dark Souls. The fans of those games are just insane. If you're, if you put up videos of you being bad of Dark Souls, you get trolled quite a bit, so I'm like, fuck that. I think it has something to do with the elitism that comes with those games. Because those games are pretty fucking elitist. People that play them are pretty damn elitist, so... I think it has a lot to do with that. The Dark Souls games, I mean. It's so hard to aim in this thing. Okay. Fucking finally. My mic slipped away from me so I couldn't really talk. <sighs> so now we got a bazooka.
Bazookas are always fun. It's funny how history repeats itself. Yet again, engine has failed to defeat you. For oh, this, we must destroy you. <laughs> oh, my aching head! I'm not feeling myself these days. So the end is in sight. Gather another five crystals, and again you will have foiled my plan. Or will you? All right, final warp room. I can't believe I'm beating this in a day. What took like days? and days to beat as a kid. <laughs> I should probably save. Whoa, where the fuck am I going? Get to the chopper. Get to the chopper! Wow! What caused the... <laughs> what killed the dinosaurs? The Ice Age! Or something. I killed the dinosaurs. The Ice Age. Okay. Bug light. Let's do fucking bug light. I'm sure, bug light will be fun. Get out of my face, son. Oh, you think you wanted me? Well, I know you want me, but you can get me. <laughs> yeah. I just don't have the endurance for that shit anymore. I'm dead. Like, I just don't have the endurance to play all day anymore. I used to, but not anymore, man. I don't, it's not like I have anything else to do, but like, it's just enduring, it's endurance. I just can't play all day anymore. I can play multiple times a day leading up to quite a few hours, but like, it's really difficult. Everything just starts to hurt. My head hurts, my back, everything. It's bad. <clears throat> Alright, this little fella will, uh... Shit, it did, it... It ate my jump input. Well, whatever, we're doing this blind. Suck all the Ds. Okay, you come with me, little fairy bastard. I need you. Oh, it was just that guy that killed me. Really? You're wasting the fairy light, dude. Three masks, are you kidding me? Well, may as well go for it. I see why they gave me three masks. Is that in recording? Um, Recording games really takes off time that I could, you know, have to play them because when I'm having to commentate and play the video game at the same time, it wears me down much quicker than when I just play the game normally. Because believe it or not, this actually wears me out quite quite significantly. It's fun as hell to do, but recording and playing wears me out quite a lot. So it's like, well... Ah, my guiding light has left. Well... <laughs> Guess I have to go through it a bit quicker then. I'm not much of a talker anyway, so it's not natural for me to be talking a shitload, so... That's an added thing to it. 
So my f when I did like I did a three hour session like a couple days ago, that damn near killed me. <laughs> I'm like, oh dear. It was co-op as well, so I was like, oh dear. Shit. I wasn't that far from the end. Although co-op is a little easier because you, you're not carrying the whole thing. You can let your partner do it. <laughs> you're like, yeah, I'm getting tired. You carry it. <laughs> you just stop talking as much. <laughs> Unless your co-op partner is incapable of carrying it. <laughs> it's probably easier for me to commentate on YouTube because I can take as many breaks as I want to. Whereas Twitch, I feel kind of obligated to continue going, even when I don't feel like it. But on YouTube, I can stop and start whenever I want to. And the internet. The internet just also just pisses me off so that affects commentary as well. Ooh, so fly. I mean effectively they're the same thing because I don't edit the way I do my commentary regardless of if people are watching or not. I just do the same thing I would do normally but it's a little more tiring on Twitch because you're in front of a live audience and I get stage fright <laughs> which sounds like the most ridiculous thing but it happens stage fright unfortunately doesn't apply to the stage <laughs> it applies to making internet videos as well as streaming <laughs> man I used to have really bad stage fright I call it that, but I don't know. I don't know any other word to describe it. I used to have it pretty bad for making videos, believe it or not. Which I've gotten over that, but the streaming bit, whenever I go to stream, I'm like, uh. Yeah. There is that. Oh shit! I mean, there is the risk you run on YouTube where you don't have any interaction. Jesus Christ. There is the risk you run of just being boring. Like, just not having anything to talk about. And some people are like that. They can just get burned out and not know. Oh my god. Some people can just get burned out and not know what to talk about or whatever. That's kind of why you see a lot of people doing the over-exaggerated stuff. To compensate for their own inadequacy of being interesting. Because <laughs> what other reason do you have to be over the top to compensate for your inadequacies of being an interesting speaker? Being an interesting and entertaining and funny speaker, that would be the correct... Shit! I just, I keep thinking I can walk past these guys and I just can't. <laughs> you fuck off. <laughs> Dear Lord. He's massive. He's big fuck. Eek! <laughs> that was never gonna last. However... Alright, let's give this another fucking go. Okay, finally we passed him. Uh, why don't you make... This is a longer message. Why don't you make a flash let's play as a new start level, cut out some stuff, just sketch it where you die and make funny stuff. 
and then the boss at the end of the level. Yeah. Some people do that, don't they? I think Nova did something similar with Saints Row. Where he would just like edit out all the other stuff and keep the entertaining stuff. Or what he deemed entertaining. Um... <sighs> oh shit! Flash Let's Play, yeah. That's an interesting concept. I'm not sure how I feel about it there. Because, I mean, I guess. Hmm. Oh shit. Serious? What the hell? I hadn't really thought about doing those. Thing is, though, I kind of, I kind of like to. I mean, I slam people often who cut out the random battles in Final Fantasy Let's Plays. Cause I'm thinking, why the fuck Let's Play it if you're gonna cut out the random battles? You know? Cause the random battles in Final Fantasy games is the game. You know? That's basically what you play the game for. Shit. You play the game for the uh, random battle, so why would you cut that out? I mean, I guess it would depend on what your goal is with making videos. Do you want to show people the entirety of the game in all of its unedited glory, or do you just want to entertain people? And I guess those two things, they, they, they do intermatch, but you can decide to just go for one or the other, I suppose. I pressed two buttons at the same time. Jump and spin. <laughs> Neither of them happened. <gasps> there we go. Like, I know H.C. Bailey. He used to... I don't know if he still does. He probably does. He used to edit out the battles in all of his Final Fantasy Let's Plays. And I'm like... Shit. He edited out, he edits, uh oh, I've got one life left. This is a really long level too, so that's actually really bad. Like, he edits out all the fights in Final Fantasy and I'm like, why? It solves some of your problems, you don't need to talk as much, so it would be more interesting by cutting out when you're not... Oh, uh, editing could be fun and you won't get bored that easily. That's true. A video could be shorter, maybe it would be interest or wider. That's that's also true. <laughs> Motherfucker. Oh, okay. Yes, life. That's exactly what I needed. Like, I don't know. I don't have that much communication with my audience typically. Um, I'll get a, I get I get quite a few views and the and not very many comments. So I honestly don't know what people that watch my videos want out of them. <laughs> oh shit. I'm gonna risk it for the biscuit. Oh! Sick. <laughs> yes! I'm so happy that that worked. However, now I think I do have to use this though, because... How do I fire the thing? Oh, there we go. Uh, whoa! Now, you can jump off of these. Oh! Shit. I'm not gonna try it, though. <laughs> I'm only doing this, um this for the lives because I'm running short. <laughs> yeah, I don't know, I hadn't really thought about making those short quick videos. Shit. I mean, yeah. Something to ponder though. 
I don't, I don't, you see, I don't give this shit much thought. I just kind of 